Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I've got you a quick 10 minute cardio routine that you can do on a busy day or when you have less time. And also it's a full body workout. You're gonna burn lots of calories and break some good sweat. And once you're ready, put on your shoes and let's begin. Let's begin to warm up the body with some stretches. Legs wide, shoulder rolls backwards. Switch the rolls forward. A big arm circles. Swaying your hips left to right. Pelvic circles. And switch the circles. Forward fold down without bending the knees, pulse your body downwards. One hand down, rotate to stretch for the other hand. And switch. And let's get into a deep wide squat, hands onto your legs. I'm gonna try and twist your upper body, dropping the shoulders left and right. Sweeping your hands up, all the way up and down, bending in for your knees. And hands taken up. Twist, twist, twist. And let's begin our very first circuit, four moves, one minute each. And the very first move is hops left and right. Keeping your abs pulled into your spine, tuck it in and breathe out with your mouth. Soften your knees as you do this. Thirty seconds to finish this move. Keep going. Next move is going to be squat out and squat in, in and out. If you want the intensity, you can jump. But if you're a beginner, you can pick the low impact version by not jumping and thrusting. Stay with me. Breathe, breathe. Twenty seconds to finish. All righty, move number three. We're going in for lunges, stepping back and forward both left and right, swinging your arms for bicep curls, keeping your body up erect and squeezing your glute muscles into you and bracing for your core. And don't forget to keep your knees soft.
lot of work almost to the end we have one last final move hands taken out high knees and kicks so you're gonna lift your knees up and kick your legs in in kick kick make sure you're not rounding your back your back is kept super straight it's just working for the legs your hips Breathe. Last ten seconds to the finish line. Good work. With that, we come to the end of the first circuit. We're going to have a one minute break. Feel free to sip some water, have a breather and get back for circuit number two once you're ready. let's hit second circuit four moves one minute each first one you're going to open your hands out touch opposite leg and arm and hop to switch if you are a beginner and want to skip the hop you can skip the intensity just stay wherever you are touching opposite arm to leg Beautiful total body workout here, arms, legs, shoulders, back, core as you crunch. Second move is going to be courtesy lunges. You're going to take one leg behind the other sideways out. And arms go parallel to shoulders. If you want an intensity, you can swing your hands all the way up in circles. Back kept straight throughout the course of move. And keep breathing. third move gonna be lunges this time you're gonna lunge back and jump center again if you're a beginner if you have knee issues lower back pain you can skip the jump Ten more seconds on this side and then we switch. Let's go switch legs, step back to hop forward. Swing your arms for intensity. Ooh. 
And we have come to the last and final move with Tapia Tan. So give your best. You're going to jump side to side and hands go forward to push back. If you're a beginner, you can opt to rule out the jump. Just step as shown. Forty seconds more on the clock. Give your best. I'm sure you're sweating, but this is going to be so worth it. You're going to feel so accomplished by the end. With that, we come to the end of the circuits. Let's get to the ground on the all fours position on your knees and hands. And give me some cat cow stretches here, arch to lower. Inhale to exhale, take your time. Let's finish with few minutes of mat work here. I want you to lift one of your leg, bending your knee to circle out. And return the circles to the inside out. Beautiful work to tone your glutes. Switch legs and circle out for your hips. And return the circles to the other side. Good work. I hope your glutes and hips are on fire. For the next 30 seconds, we're getting into the good old full plank. Try to scoop the belly inside. Squeeze your butt cheeks. We have 15 seconds on the clock. Stay strong as you keep breathing. And with that, we come to the end of the workout. Let's get into some cool down stretches and restoration. Child's resting pose. Send your glutes down to your legs. Extend your arms. Your forehead drops heavy down to the mat. Hold here to breathe. Coming up on your elbows, palms down, lift your butt up, arch your back to look up for the puppy dog stretch. Thread one of your hand under, drop the shoulder and the side of your head down to the ground for the thread and the needle stretch. and switch to the other side. Coming up, sitting on your legs like so, taking both your hands behind for a nice back release. As you look up, And one last final counter stretch for a nice child's pose. Forward with your head down, shoulders relax, your arms flowing down as you breathe.
Well done, everyone. I really hope that you enjoyed this full body cardio routine. Great workout from head to toe, working large muscle groups. And I hope that you broke some good sweat. If you like this video, do thumbs it up and leave me your thoughts in the comments below. And do come back to my channel for more at home workout videos with me. Thank you so much and I'll see y'all very soon.